Not sure if the camera can pick them up, but there's just hundreds upon hundreds of bees crisscrossing all up and all over the place up above me. They're all coming from Hegemon, <coughs> which I'm thinking they're swarming because I've never seen an orientation flight this large. So now I get the fun job of trying to watch to see where they go, figure out which tree they do decide to take. Hopefully it's uh, one close by, one that's not too high up that I can get to real easily. <clears throat> and I'll have to try to find a, uh, a place for them because I'm sort of out of equipment. Kind of wish I finished that top bar high with all the top bars. Now let's go for the bee perspective. <clears throat> this is so cool looking. It's like Chloris and Anthe have decided to make a showing at the entrance. Neither of those hives really have enough to swarm. B has decided to land on the bed. Well, they still don't seem like they're going in any specific direction yet. There's just a bunch of them flying around up in front of the yard. There seems to be a lot of activity above the shed. Up by the swarm box I put up there. I really hope they move into that because that's one of the last empty hives I actually have. Not sure if the camera is good enough quality to pick this up, but there's a lot of things flying around up on this tree right here. <coughs> Which is right near my ladder so I wouldn't have to move very far. 
which I would appreciate. Oh, but it does have a lot of high branches. I really hope to go to that swarm box. Let, the, let this swarm catch itself. <coughs> here. Still don't see any in the far tree line where I caught the other two swarms. Yeah, the most activity seems to be that tree above the shed. And there appears to be no bees over by the swarm trap I set up on the play structure. So apparently I'm going to be going from two to uh, eight hives this year. This is pretty crazy. It seems we have furry aphids on this tree, which we got to take care of again this year. <clears throat> I think they might have found a landing spot, which fortunately looks like the really tall is that oak tree maple tree no that's a nest of something if they go up there I have no idea how I'm gonna get them down 